I just posted a video that showed you how to customize colors in Photoshop CS5 and then I got questions about if that was possible in Photoshop Elements. I have Adobe Photoshop Elements open now and I'm going to show you how you can do the same thing but it's a little bit different. You need to always remember that Photoshop Elements costs less and it's a very stripped down version of Photoshop so while these things are possible sometimes it takes a little more, bit more work to customize the templates the way you want. Uh, changing colors is a little bit complicated but very doable. So the first thing I'm going to do is make sure that I have this patented color overlay uh, layer selected. Now I can't change the image, the image colors directly from here as I did before. The easiest way I found to change the color is go to layer, new fill layer, solid color. I'm just going to click OK and it's going to default to white and I'm just going to click OK for right now and we're going to come back and change that. So now you can see I have this new color fill layer directly over my pattern color overlay. With this layer selected, I'm going to come up here and I'm going to change this to overlay, which is going to let my color and my pattern come through from the background. And now I'm going to be able to customize the color itself. So I'm just going to double click on here and it's going to open up my color picker. And just like before, I can choose a color from my image, uh, the background, uh, you know, browns, whatever I want. and then from there, if I want to customize it more, I can move it around um, in here to get the exact look and feel that I'm going for. And then just click OK. And then you'll be able to save out your image right here, uh, just the same as we did in CS5.